Hey, what's up, daywalkers and fellow travelers of the night? I wanted to show this set off because I'm very happy to have it. I know a lot of you have probably already seen these nine cards put together, but this is the three by three puzzle from Midnight Suns. And I was really happy that each of these cards we were missing, like the three we got in the boxes we opened, we had three full boxes we opened and then 12 loose packs, which obviously make up a fourth box, but I don't know where they all came from. I don't know if they all came from the same box. And judging by some of the hits, though, I would say they probably didn't. But what we have here is we got Moon Knight, Blade, and Ghost Rider in our three boxes, which was epic. Uh, I think one of them might have been in the loose pack too. So we were just missing these six around the corner here, and those were all the cheaper ones to buy. These were each maybe like two, three bucks each on Com C. So really cool that we got them at this price and only spent about 20, 25 bucks to complete the set. I mean, just epic. To get it into that $80 that we were trying to spend, was so awesome. I'm so glad we got to do that. So this is something for me. Some of those Moon Knight cards we got, you know, it's me in blue, but mostly blue and it'll go in his collection. But this was the thing I wanted. It has Moon Knight in the center. We already had him. So it still counts as a Moon Knight piece. But this is kind of all the characters, most of them anyway, that were in Damnation. Although it has Vengeance in it, which he was not part of Damnation. And also Danny Ketch in his Death Rider gear, which was not around during Damnation. But you had Johnny Blaze and Jennifer Kale and Frank Drake, who were also not in Damnation. <laughs> so it's not perfect, you know, It's uh, but it is mostly like some of the characters are in Damnation and then other versions of Midnight Suns characters. So it's not perfect to Damnation, you know, it's just got some like Scarlet Spider was in Damnation and stuff. And so it's got some of the characters, but it's mainly just like a tribute to almost every iteration of the Midnight Sun. So I really like this piece. I think it's beautiful. It looks awesome. Uh, Jennifer Kale here, I think she's going to appear in the Agatha All Along show coming up soon. So I'll be interested to see what they do with that character in that show. Hopefully we get some Ghost Rider stuff and Blade in the Marvel Universe. I know we kind of did with Blade. We got Wesley Snipes, the original, um, and the one and only. <laughs> you know, sorry, Sticky Fingers. So we kind of scratched that Blade itch a little bit, but obviously more Blade is good for me, at least. More of the supernatural Marvel characters I'd be all into seeing. So I'm interested to see Agatha when that comes out, see how that sets up more of the supernatural side of Marvel and uh, leaning off of like Wanda and everything, but hopefully setting up characters more like Werewolf by Night, who we got in a special and was awesome, and Man-Thing, and Elsa Bloodstone. Like, these are characters I want to see come back. So I'm all for pushing things forward, uh, you know, in the supernatural universe and space of the Marvel Universe. So having this is awesome. And on the back, you know, it has each character's name and what spot they're in. And they're not really exactly where they're supposed to be. Like, this says card two, but it's down here in this spot. And no matter where you put it in a binder, which direction, it's not card two. <laughs> so so anyway, I just was like, all right, well, that wasn't planned out too, too well. But it's still, this is gorgeous. It's a great piece. And I actually think what we're going to do is frame this as opposed to putting in a binder. Because I just love the image so much. It's so awesome to have all these different iterations of the Midnight Suns all together. Just to kind of, as an homage to versions we've seen in the past and stuff. And Moon Knight being the centerpiece... Just fantastic bringing all this together. I love it. So let me know what you think down below. Do you have this set? Do you collect the nine, you know, piece three by threes? I know Wolverine one is out and I'm probably not going to buy that one or get the pieces for that one. So I have some pieces to trade if anyone out there is interested in trading. But to complete this for me is awesome. It's a home run. And I just wanted to show it off for those who might not have seen it, uh, but or just some of you who want to hear my thoughts on it. I love it. Short, long story short, I love this, and I'm happy to have it for our collection. Thanks so much for watching the show. As always, like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and we'll see you in hell. Peace.